What's good everyone, it's Adam from Miami Music Mobile. Welcome to a brand new video. Today we're gonna go ahead and remake J Hus Who Told You featuring Drake from scratch. So the tempo for this one is 114 beats per minute and the track is produced by P2J. We're gonna start off with the main keys that we hear throughout the entire track. So I'm gonna go ahead and on this off transfer track, I'm gonna bring in the vintage electric piano and I'm gonna bring in the deluxe modern preset. And let's go ahead and draw on that pattern. Now let's go ahead and add in the bass notes. Now all I wanna do here is just make everything a little bit softer so it's not so hard hitting. All right, the next thing I wanna do is select all of my notes over here, hit I on my keyboard, to bring up the inspector. And I'm gonna to go to quantize eighths and I'm gonna add in some Q flam just to get the notes to strum a little bit. So let's go ahead and pull this up and you see the notes moving off of each other, just like that. Let's do something, something like that, 70 is fine. Now let's layer this keyboard with a pluck type of sound. I'm gonna go ahead and create a new software instrument track. I'm gonna go over to orchestral. I'm gonna to go to keyboards and I'm gonna bring in the Celesta preset. I'm gonna copy down the same pattern. I'm gonna take out these bass notes here. I take this, I'm just gonna pull up the velocity so it hits a little harder. That's a little high, let's bring down one octave. Now we're gonna adjust the length of that Celesta instrument. I don't want it to ring out too much. I'm just gonna bring that back like this. something like that. Now let's go ahead and group these two tracks together. And I'm gonna add in a chorus effect to give it a more softer, wider sound. So I'm gonna go over to the mega wide chorus preset. It's a little too wide, let's bring that back a bit. All right, that sounds good. Next, let's go ahead and bring in the drums. We'll create a new software instrument track and I've already created a drum kit for this remake. We'll go to drum kits. Go all the way down to who told you drum kit and let's start off with something easy like the kick. Next let's get to our shaker. And because it's hitting all at the same velocity, I'm just gonna switch it up to give it more of a realistic feel. So we'll do something like this. Let's ramp this one up here. Now let's put in the first snare. Let's bring in our first perk sound. Another perk sound to layer the kick. Now let's get to the log drum. All right, now let's get to that first Vox sound. Let's go ahead and just stretch this out to 32 steps and take out the second one. Now let's add in our second log drum. Now let's add in another stick sound. Except we only wanted to hit on the one, so let's go to 64 and take out this. 
this and this. And let's add in our clap sound. All right, so we got the keys and a whole bunch of drums. Now let's get to that bass. I'm creating a new softer instrument track. And for this one, I'm going to bring in Logic's Retro Synth. And we're just gonna start off with a preset in Retro Synth. For that, I'm gonna go over to my preset section. I'm gonna to go to Synth Bass, and I'm gonna to go to Heavy Punch Bass. And let's go ahead and draw in that pattern. Copy that over to the next bar. And on the retro synth, I'm not gonna really do much to it. I'm just gonna pull up the envelope a little bit just so it's a little bit more smackier. Now let's get to the strings that are sort of in the background, just one note. Let's go ahead and create a new soft instrument track. I'm gonna go over to orchestral. I'm gonna go to strings and I'm gonna go to cellos. And once again, it's just one note. So let's go ahead and draw that in right now. Now let's just go ahead and repeat that. So it's gonna take this, repeat that over, command R and then Apple J to join that. Now let's add in one more keyboard sound just to fill this all out. I'm gonna create a new software instrument track. And for this, I'm gonna go ahead and bring in Logic's Alchemy. I'm gonna start off with a preset. It can be found under keys. We're gonna to go to electric and we're gonna find a preset called the Aurora over Iceland. duplicate that over and I'm just going to highlight them all and just bring down the velocity a little bit hold down the release I'm just going to bring that into the keyboard section And that's pretty much it. Now all it needs is a little bit of arrangement and we got the entire track. Logic users out there, I'm gonna go ahead and save this entire session for you. Place it as a downloadable link below this video. If you don't use Logic, I got your back as well. I'm gonna go ahead and export all the mini stems, audio stems, and of course include the drum kit that you heard in this remake. You can find that playback down below the like button as well. If you do have any questions on this or just want to chat, let's go ahead and talk in the comment section below. But other than that, thanks for watching. We'll catch you on the next one. Later. Peace.